Hello again. I want to explain the cycle sorting algorithm. Okay, so here I have six, uh, six numbers. So uh, let's start it with the first position here. So here I have 10. Uh, erase it from here. So at first I will explain what mean one cycle and then uh, we will understand what means cycle sorting. Okay. So uh, we have 10. So we must calculate the number of numbers that less than 10. So 1, for example, is less than 10. 4 also is less than 10. And minus 1, 5, and 0. So we have 5 numbers are less than 10. So I have 5 numbers less than 10. So 5 plus the index of the first position. So I start with 1. So that's 5 plus 1. That means that uh, 10, I must put it in the position 6. Okay? So 5 plus 1 is 6. So that means I must put 10 here. Okay? So I put 10 here. And now I have 0. I exchange between 10 and 0. Okay? So for, ten, for 0 now, for 0, how many number is less than 0? So I have just minus 1 is less than 0. So I have just one number is less than 0. So that means that I must put 0 in the position 1 plus the first index. So that means that I must put 0 in the position 2 here so the cycle is so I, I won't stop until I put a number here okay so that's one cycle and then I continue with the other numbers okay so for one now how many number is less than one I have zero and one so I have two two plus one is three so that means that I must put 1 in the third position. So I permute between 1 and 4. Uh, for this number here, <coughs> uh, for this number, uh, 4, how many number is less than 4? I have this and this and this. I have 3. 3 plus 1 equal 4. So that means that I must put 4 in the fourth position here. So I put 4 and I have minus 1. So uh, how many number is less than uh, minus 1? So there is no number is less than minus 1. So I have 0 number. 0 plus 1 is equal 1. So that means I must put it here. So that's one, one cycle. Remember that I, I get 10 from this place and I return a number here. So that's one cycle. Here you see that the array is uh, sorted, but in this, just in this case, the array is sorted. Okay? Because you, you must, now you must get zero. The next case. Okay? So zero, how many number is less than zero? Uh, there is this, just one. So, uh, one plus one is equal to, uh, so that means that I must put zero in the second. So here there is no number. So that means this is a cycle also. And then I start from this, I get one and so on, okay? One, one, there is two. Number is less, less than one. 2 plus 3 uh, plus 1 is equal 3, so I put it here, so that's a cycle because I return a number here, and so on, okay? So that's it. I hope that you will see this video helpful for you, and thank you for watching.